Hey guys! So sorry for the wait, but this is the Moving In series. Also, the plan for this series is that um, I was planning on getting the Coastal Villa, but I still have to like, like ask for it and stuff. So um, I'm probably not going to get that until like a while. So for now, I'm just going to move the current family out the house. But like when like they move back in, it's going to be decorated all, all like fall and stuff. So it's going to be the same house, just like different like layout and decorations. So please just hold, just, just, just hold right now, okay? But right now, this is the first part of moving out. Oh, this is so stressful. I'm glad we have everything packed up right now, though. Just have boxes all around. Now we have to go to the other house. I told you an hour ago to, like, undo this bed. Yeah, but Dad, I don't know how to, so that's the thing. All right, um, I think this would be good. This would be quick, and we can set up the old bed. Why are we even moving anyway? We just need a new change. And I think you're going to love the new house, okay? Yeah, sure. I'm moving far away from all my friends too. So I'm going to have to go to a new school with new friends. And I hate going to a new school. Because then the teacher's all like, let's do popcorn. And then I have to introduce myself. And I and it's so embarrassing. You're a likable person, okay? So there's no need to worry about having to be in any drama or anything. Well, can we at least come here to visit? Yes, we can come here to visit, but since we are moving kind of far away, it's not going to be very often. So really, your only choice is to just call your friends. That's easy for you to say. You don't even have any friends anyway. Okay, I do have friends. Then why do they never talk to you? They do talk to me. They just don't come over. They live far away just like, just like how we're going to. Alright, the funny thing is that you didn't have to bring that up again. Oh, I'm sorry. Can you hear me the drill? I wonder when the salesperson's going to get here. Ding dong. Oh, perfect timing. I just really hope the kids aren't screaming right now. Oh, thanks for cleaning. Yeah, you told me to. I've only done that half of the house. And I have to do this whole kitchen, then upstairs, and then your floor. All right, be glad you're not doing the dishes. Or taking apart beds. Sorry for the long wait. Oh, no, you're good. So, you're selling the house? Yeah, well, we just need a new change. All right, well, it seems you got everything packed up pretty well. Yeah, we just need a U-Haul to get here, and I think we'll be good in set to the new house well that's amazing i hope your family's adjusting to it well uh most of them Ooh, look at her she is fine no wait don't Ooh, you look so good right now andrew <laughs> do you want to you know hook up one day okay get your kid oh my god i'm so sorry let me, let me have this talk real quick <laughs> what are you doing well she just looks so good okay but she's like 10 times her age so so that's bad age is just a number do not ever say anything in that in my house one more time go into the corner right now no but i don't want to then stop acting like that okay <laughs> sorry about that oh no you're you're fine well should we get into the meeting yep we can start talking about it hey guys so this is going to be the second part of moving out. Yeah, I think that's what it's called. But first, let's get a free gift. Did you guys like get well, last the last gift? Because it's so cute. Okay, let's see. Oh, I got two. I haven't went and took a burger for a while. Okay, looks like they're pets or animals. Oh, oh my god, wait, this one is so cute. Okay, this one has to be a pet or an animal. Wait, they're both so cute. I might put this in the new fall house. Okay, guys, anyway, let's get on with the role play. Yes, we should, but I'm so sorry for that. That was my first occurrence, but no, you're you're okay. After they talk some things out. Well, it looks here that you're on the list. Perfect, thank you. And this is your house insurance, so we'll just have you sign that. And just so you know, once you sign those papers, there's no going back. You sold the house. All right, I think I'm ready sold my whole life away yes you sure did the u-haul will be coming in about 30 minutes to make sure everything is packed and all your kids are ready all right perfect thank you so much i guess we'll be meeting again when i get the new house yes we will and we'll get going thank you so much for your time oh that's no problem goodbye bye all right guys let's get move on after everything is packed up and that's it guys Ugh, i don't even know why we're moving anyway we have to go to a whole new like place we have to go to florida Yes, it's a big change, but I swear your life is going to change drastically. Yeah, 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 whatever. Alright guys, let's hop into the car. 
Are you guys excited to see the new house? No. No, I can't lie. Okay, I'm kind of excited too. But at least someone is. We are. No, I'm pretty excited too. Iris, just hear me out. Once you actually settle in and you go to Florida, maybe you can make some new friends at your new school. But the thing is, I don't want to make new friends. I like the friends I had at my old school. Yes, we know that, but sometimes you can go visit them and maybe take a trip to California. We're almost moving across the state. I don't know what you mean. But you'll be in Florida. Isn't Florida like your dream place to live in? Their houses are so nice. See, you can be happy about that. The only thing I'll be happy for is that if we have a new house and I actually go to a good school this time, we'll make sure that happens just for you. All right, fine. At the airport. Oh, pretend she has shoes on, okay? All right, come on, let's get checked in before we miss our flight. Um, tickets? Oh, yes, we have them online. Last name? Joelle Elias? Yes, Joelle Elias. All right, you can go on. On the plane. Hmm, cool flight we have here. Hello everyone, welcome aboard. Make sure all cellular devices are on airplane mode. The seatbelt sign will be on until we get to our cruising the part of the flight. And once we're about to land, we will start cleaning up the cabin and the seatbelt sign will be on. So you guys will have to fasten your seatbelts. We are hoping for a smooth and fast flight. And our next stop will be Florida. Thank you guys and welcome aboard. This flight is so packed. Yeah, tell me about it, but we'll be at a perfect destination when we get there. Hey guys, so I'm not sure what part this is, but it's like, I don't know. It's one of the parts. And also guys, I've been really focusing on school and I haven't been posting a lot, so just sorry about that. And my dog's barking. After the flight. All right guys, we have landed in Florida. Everyone should be um, getting their bags and start ex exiting. And I hope you have a good stay in Florida. Yay, finally. I know, I'll hold the kids. Can you just get the bags please? It's not that much. Okay, fine. I am so ready to go to the beach. Let's go to the beach. Each just going away. Okay, kids, that's enough. Bing, 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 bing. Oh, I think our Uber's out. Um, outside. Oh, okay. Come on, kids. Come on, the Uber's outside. Oh, this is so annoying. I hate moving. In the Uber. At the house. Wow, this is nice. Girl, this is all this you right here okay it don't smell like roaches in here or nothing there'll soon be roaches in here when this house gets dirty again little girl do not talk like that just because you're upset that we're moving doesn't mean that you have to back talk everyone yes it does it's so stupid we move a million times a year you still can't find the right spot well florida is the right spot okay all of our family lives here it's right by the beach. You'll be fine. Yeah, but moving schools isn't fine. I hate being known as a new kid. I'm sitting at lunch for at least two months without any friends. And then it just looks like I'm a loner. Then I always get bullied. Ugh, it's just too much. Mom, just please stop talking to me. Okay. Well, guys, this is a new house. Wow, this is so good. I know this place is humongous. I can't wait to make a big mess in here. All right, not so close. We just got this house, so... No making big messes for, well, until a while. Wow, this is actually pretty nice. See, I told you it wasn't even that bad. Okay, Iris is the one complaining, not me. Okay, everyone, go find the rooms. Mmm, nah. I call the biggest room. No, I call it. Ha, I call this room. Well, let me see it first. Oh my god, this is humongous. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Look, I even get a balcony. Okay, I'll probably have Dad put some blackout curtains here. And then make this little bathroom. <sighs> like that out of work. Okay, you're just mad that I have a balcony and your room probably doesn't. Whatever, I'm not even jealous. Okay, this room is big. Hmm, I actually might take this room. Yeah, but what are you going to put in it? This room is way too big for me. A bed, a dresser, maybe my own TV, a couch, a gaming area. Mm, let's see what else. Okay, fine, I get it. And you got your own bathroom. Cool, I don't even care. My room is so much more bigger than yours, and it also has a balcony that's probably going to be turned into the most best and calming bathroom you have ever seen. But what if the what if it's like really windy, and the wind blows the curtains, and they just see you taking a shower? Yeah, that's going to be taped down real good. Something like that's never going to happen, okay? Yeah, whatever, but this is my room. I guess mom and dad's room is upstairs, and then the kids' room are downstairs. That's how it's supposed to be, I guess. This is part five, I think. So I think we could make this room maybe a kitchen, dining room, and a living room. Yeah, that sounds pretty nice. Meanwhile. Okay, guys. So I think 
the I I think the I think the I. <laughs> so I think sissy and brother went upstairs to go choose their room. So I think they have the room, the two rooms upstairs. So I think our rooms are gonna be over here. Come on, follow me. Oh, okay. Ooh, this is so nice. I think we could have like a bunk bed and one of the beds can be floating. We have a desk right here and then we can have a TV and we can have a couch. It's going to be so cool. Oh my god, yes. Okay, but I think we have to go back to the car because we have to check into a hotel for a few months. Actually, are we going with grandma? Yeah, I think we're going with grandma. I kind of hate grandma. Why does she make cookies every single, like, week? I don't know, but her cookies are so good. Okay, that's so true. Her cookies are so good. Sometimes I get up in the middle of the night to go sneak some cookies. I mean, they're so good. OMG, and when they're freshly baked too, that's the that's the best. Because they're all soft in the middle, but they're crunchy on the outside. It's just so good. Good thing we got everything planned out. Kids, come on, we have to go to grandma's. Okay, let's go. Okay, guys, don't mind that it's snowing. I just didn't, I don't have another house that's decorated. So just like, don't mind that. Knock, knock, knock. Oh, I think they're here. Hello, babies. Hi, Grandma. Hi, Mom. Haven't seen you in a long time, haven't I? Hey. Oh, my grandbabies. I'm so excited to see you. How long are you going to be here for? Oh, just until the house is done. It won't take very long, I don't think. Sorry, guys. My dog is barking, so just don't ignore that. I'm so happy to see you. Let's time to, it's, we got time to catch up. Oh, yes. Once they all get inside. Oh, my. Y'all have grown so much. Yes, I don't even know when's the last time you've seen them. Wait, how old are you guys again? I'm 13. I'm 17. Oh, when you guys were 9 and 10, I think that's when the last time we saw you guys. Oh, yes, yes. Isn't it a little chilly outside? Yes, I mean, I can't believe it's raining right now. Was traffic hard to get through? No, not that really. It was kind of good. We even left their old toys here. I don't even know when's the last time we've seen them. Even when we were babies, you know? Yeah, but I'm so happy to... You know, finally be here. It's so cozy in here. Once they catch up a bit. Ah, 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 ah. Ooh, isn't it getting a little late? What time is it? Oh my, it's 10. I think it's the kids' bedtime. You know what? I'm pretty tired myself. I think we should just all, all just go to sleep. Ooh, right. All this laughing wore me off. All right, kids. Good night. Sorry for the cram sleeping tonight. I know I know we moved to this more smaller pace, but I think it'll do for now. Oh yes, don't worry about us. Well, that's perfect. I hope you guys sleep well. Good night. Night, Grandma. Night, Grandpa. <sighs> Hope their house gets decorated soon. Me too, but it's gonna be nice seeing our grandparent our grandbabies back. A few months later. Part six of moving out slash in. A few months later. It was so nice seeing you guys again. Oh yes, I very much missed you guys, and I'm glad that we could spend some family time together, you know, bond a little bit. Yes, that was perfect. Well, I hope you guys come time come and visit sometime soon. Thank you. We'll see you guys later. Bye kids. Bye guys. Bye. All right, on the road again, and we'll be there to our new decorated nice house. Aren't you guys so excited? You're going to enroll into a new school, and it's just going to be amazing. This is a perfect fit for us. I'm telling you, Mom, I want to go back to California. I hate moving. Why do you have to move to Florida anyway? I told you, we have so much more family here. The houses are so much cheaper, and they're nicer too. Mom, do you know the hurricanes that happen here? It rains so bad over here. Good thing that we have supplies. Yeah, so don't worry about any think any damage on the hurricanes. We're all gonna be safe and we're all gonna be okay. I'm actually kind of excited to see the new house. Surprised you would say that. Okay guys, don't start fighting now. It's not the long of drive, just two more hours. Alright. A few hours later. Oh okay, everyone's sleeping. Guys, wake up, we're at the new house. <sighs> Ugh, already? Yep, the sun is just not coming up. All right, guys, let's see the new de decorated house. Also, guys, I changed the house because the other house was, like, it was just too big and I didn't know what to do with it. And also, this house is highly, like, uh, like, I got my ideas from Kaylee's Boca, like, like, a loss that I didn't really know what to do. So, um, yeah, credits to her. And if my voice sounds a little weird, I just got over from being, oh, I just got over from being sick and yeah weren't you guys so excited no that's easy for you to say you even want to be in this house anyway mom as i told you i want to be in california not in florida and i already told you this that this is a perfect fit for us and all of our family is close to us 
We're also near the coast, so we can have a beach close to us. It's perfect. You know what? Just open the door. I want to go to my room. Okay, guys. <gasps> OMG, this is so nice. OMG. Oh, I can't wait to see our rooms. Oh, this house is nice and decorated how I, like, imagined it. Oh, this house is so ugly. I hate it so much. Okay, Iris, I'm pretty sure that your room is on the third story. Oh, when ours is on the second story on the far left, I think. Brayden, I think your room is on the left, closer to the elevator. And the triplets are right next to your room. Eee! Oh my god, a room to myself? Now this is a life. Let's see if they put all my clothes inside my, inside my dresser. Oh wow, they actually did. Uh, this is the perfect size room. Not too big, but not too small. I have my own TV. I have a bunk bed. I can choose either bed. So I'm kind of scared of heights. So I think I'm just going to go onto the second story bunk bed and then you can go up there on the highest bed and then you go on the bottom bunk perfect amazing oh wow this is actually pretty nice i love it i'm gonna let the kids play on the floor for a little bit and i think we can just you know chillax this room is everything that we've wanted yes it's amazing i love it i hope the kids aren't doing the rooms yeah, Iris was a little, you know, skeptical about it, but I really hope that she likes her room. Everything that she told us, um, we got the designers to do whatever. I hope they did it how she wanted it to be. Oh my god. I did not expect my room to come out how I exactly imagined it. Oh my god, wait. Okay, maybe my room isn't so bad, but the rest of the house is horrible. And having to go to a school? No, thank you. Whatever, as long as I'm happy. As long as I'm happy with my room and not worried about anything else, I think I'll be good. Okay guys, that's the end of this roleplay, bye.